If a Hollywood studio wanted to fake a Mars landing, I would suggest they come here to the Atacama Desert. I'm here to drive the brand new 2019 Audi Q8. The Q8 is the new face of Audi's SUV family. It's based on the Q7, but it stands out with its own design. It's got different headlights, it's got a wider grille, and it's got vertical slats that add kind of a sportier and more muscular appearance. The Q8 is based on the same platform as the bigger Q7. It's also on the same bones as the Bentley Bentayga and the Porsche Cayenne. Compared to the Q7, you can tell it's shorter, it's lower, and it's also a little bit wider. The sporty design continues as you look at the side of the car. It's got a much more rakish roofline than the Q7 and Audi infused styling cues from the Sport Quattro, which is the iconic coupe that dominated rallies in the 1980s. The Sport Quattro styling cues include the pronounced wheel arches and the wide roof pillar. The Q8 is also the first Audi with 22 inch wheels, which you can see on our test car. Out back, it's a mix of modern and classic styling cues. The light bar comes from the latest A7, while the black panel is again from the Sport Quattro. The base Q8 comes with a twin turbocharged 3 liter V6 engine that makes 335 horsepower. It spins the four wheels through an eight speed automatic transmission and Audi's time tested Quattro all wheel drive system. Audi put a big influence on technology while developing the Q8. It splits the cockpit into three parts. You have the digital core, so that's the two screens on the center console. This one runs the infotainment system, so radio, phone, media, navigation, etc. This one is primarily for the climate control. You've also got the mechanical wrap. That's the trim you see on either side of the touchscreen and on the center console. And finally, the soft cover. That's everything, all the soft touch material right here, the leather on the seats, on the armrest, and the Alcantara on the door pillars. The base Q8 is plenty peppy as is, but Audi tells me there's a very good chance we'll see more powerful variants, including an SQ8 and maybe even an RSQ8. Both could come with V8 power. The 2019 Audi Q8 will go on sale at the end of this year. Audi has not announced pricing yet, but it's targeting the Porsche Cayenne and the Range Rover Sport.